guys, Kayla here. Today I'm going to show you how you can access the music on your iPod without using iTunes. As I'm sure most of you know, I've already done a video about this. The other video I did, however, was for a touchscreen iPod, so an iPod Touch, an iPad, or an iPhone, anything with a touchscreen. The video I'm doing today is for any other kind of iPod, so any iPod that does not have a touchscreen. Alright, so there's two different ways you can do this. So the first way is the same as with a touchscreen iPod. We'll just open this program here called SharePod. And now I'm going to connect my iPod to my laptop. Once again, iTunes pops up, so we're just going to minimize this for now. Alright, so here's my iPod, and here's all the songs that I have on it. So once again, you can right-click, and it gives you the option to preview, auto-transfer everything, and a bunch of other options. And we have all those options down here again as well. So that's the first way you can access the music on it, without iTunes. And the second way, you don't need to download any programs or anything. All you have to do is go to this folder here. And now you're going to double-click on your iPod. As you can see right now, all you have access to is recordings, photos, notes, DCIM, contacts, and calendars. So right now you can't see any music on the iPod. Now we're going to minimize this for a minute. And we're going to go into the control panel. And you're going to type in folder options. And then you're going to go to Show Hidden Files and Folders. Right now it's set so that you do not see hidden files, folders, or drives. So we want to switch this. You're going to highlight Show Hidden Files, Folders, and Drives. Then you're going to click on Apply and OK. So now you can exit out of the control panel. And we're going to bring up this folder again. And now you see another folder here. It's called iPod Control. So we're going to click on this. And now you have access to the artwork, device, game data, Games RO, Game Stats, iTunes Music, Speakable, and Tones. So you're going to click on Music, and this has all the songs on your iPod. Now the only downfall is you can't actually tell what the song is called without listening to it. So I'm just going to right click on one of these here and play it, just to show you guys that it is actually a song. It shows up as Paradise by Coldplay. So now we're going to go back to the folders, and there's a whole bunch of different ones here. It's F00, and it goes all the way down to F49. So most of the folders here, if not all of them, should have songs in them or audiobooks. Because if you have any audiobooks on your iPod, it's going to show up with the music as well. So I'm just going to click on another one here. So here's Strike the Numbers by Trapped. So this is really how easy it is to access the music on your iPod without iTunes. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial and I will see you in my next video.